I can remember when I first started in the field, people would ask me what I did, and I'd say I worked at a wastewater treatment plant, and they would say, oh, you mean you take water out of the river and you treat it? They'd say, no, no, well, what's a wastewater treatment plant? I'd have to explain specifically what a wastewater treatment plant is. And I think it's a good opportunity for the public, you know, to see exactly how important a wastewater treatment plant is. We have, this industry is losing a lot of people. Look around, it's not these guys, because these guys are young, but look at the other people in this industry. We're all older people, and we've already had four people retiring, and have another one, unfortunately, that what we can never fill. But we're going to have a lot of people retiring in this industry. There's going to be a lot of jobs, different types of jobs, jobs for college degrees, jobs for not too, more technical uh, uh, skills. So there's all kind of opportunities. So if you take one thing away, think of the possibility of having a career or a job in the wastewater or the environmental industry. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Why are there so many in the environment 2013? <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Alright, so we were hired by the Career Center of Lowell, Massachusetts. All four of us work under the supervision of Megan McNamara, who works for the NEIWPCC and is the, the coordinator of this program. This program is meant, uh, meant to teach the younger minds of America to understand the important aspects of having a water treatment plant. Um, the daily routine is, um, this was a five week program that started in July 8th and ended in August 14th. At the beginning of every week, we are given the choice of what position slash job you want to do. And when the next week starts, we all switch jobs. When the job is done for the day, we all gather up and are given a lesson at, at lunch. At the end of every week, we go to field trips. Or, uh, we we stop them from we try to stop them from dumping oil like from your car or wherever they might get oil from into the sewer because that can be hazardous to the water supply. And engineering, um, they kind of work hand in hand. They check the water levels at various manhole covers, um, which are very heavy, by the way, <laughs> 150 pounds. Um, I've worked with um, John and Carrie right here. Um, we've mapped out the entire sewer system of Lowell, um, which actually hasn't been done before. I think John told me that. Um, yeah. Down to Merrimack and to Lowell. She's like, oh, well, do you guys know where that is? And we're like, well, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're all familiar with that. Is. Is. But it, it's just interesting to know that Lowell. water, our water is coming all the way from up there. So. Yeah, like you were saying, we think it just disappears. We know for a fact it does not disappear. They got Oak Madero. <laughs> Thank you to everyone. Um, should I?